Can you build a civilization to last the test of time? Oh man, the nostalgia goggles are uh, are, are firmly affixed to the horse's head. Ah, uh, they are they are they're 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 duct taped on there, you know. Hell, there might actually be even like two layers going on, you know. I've got the uh, maybe have some nostalgia spectacles. <laughs> I can, but only in Civ One. <laughs> I've not, I've not actually uh, I've not actually tried Civ One or two. Uh, I'll talk a little bit more about uh about Civ Three, but uh yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. Got got like the nostalgia spectacles, and then I have the nostalgia goggles on over it. Um, yeah, it's uh, Awe. Good to see everyone. Iggy, Buckethead, Yeeny. Fantastic of you all to drop in. <clears throat> this is gonna be a good one. This should be a good one. I don't know. L l let's start. Let's start. Cause the audio's looking fine. So uh, before I say too much, let's let's start. Awe Amiki, my name is Faustus Marius and Catatus, the true consul of Rome, the favorite horse of the god Emperor Caligula. I hope you are having a fantastic week so far. Uh it's been a it's been a it's been a few days for me. It's it's been a it's been a special special couple of days for me, I think. Um so <laughs> uh so yesterday um apparently there were uh, there were protests at one of the high schools because um both the uh, the teachers and the students were very displeased that a uh that uh the the principal was on her way to be sacked uh, pretty much uh like so there were protests so on friday last friday um most of them didn't show up like half the teachers and two-thirds of the students did not show up so uh the following monday even though it made not a whole lot of sense because the walkout was announced ahead of time and they weren't doing anything on Monday. The following Monday, the uh, the district in their infinite wisdom said, "Okay, well we need to uh we need to bring in a bunch of substitute teachers just to be safe. You do, you, you don't have to you don't actually have like a class you're covering or anything. We're just going to bring you in just to be safe in case everybody walks off the job again." So uh so guess what I got to do on Monday? I got to uh, I got to sit around in in the high school library and uh, read a uh, read a high school level book about the Italian Renaissance. Um, and that was that was my day yesterday, and I got paid to do that. And uh, not really sure how to feel about it. Not really sure how to feel about it. Easy money for one, but uh, at the same time, it was incredibly boring. And I came home. A as strange as it sounds, I know. Uh, yeah, sounds like a good day to me. Yeah, yeah. As strange as it sounds, I came home feeling pretty drained. Um, and I, I can't believe I'm saying it. I've I've worked difficult jobs before, you know. I've I've worked jobs where I've, uh, you know, come home covered in dirt and uh, exhausted to the bone. Um, but uh, but yeah, yeah. I, I was I was uh, it was it was draining yesterday. Just sitting there doing nothing all day. So. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. It was easy money at the same time. Uh, not sure I would want to do it again anytime soon. Um, and God, it's just it's just silly. It's just silly. They they announced the walkout ahead of time, you know, like they 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 weren't doing anything on on Monday. So why would you assume? Why would you assume? It wasn't just me. They brought in a lot of people. They paid a lot of people for nothing yesterday. Anyways. Um, <laughs> Today was a little better. Gotta say though, protests against the school official leaving isn't something I've ever heard of. Yeah, I know, right? Must be really well liked. I think she was. I think she was. Um, and I think, uh, without getting into too much detail, I think, uh, <laughs> I think she was made to take the fall for something that, uh, probably was not her fault, but, uh, you know, it just looks bad, so we're going to fire the principal, right? Um... But yeah, yeah, that was uh, that was yesterday. And then today I uh, today I went shopping because my uh, grandma horse's birthday is coming up, uh, a big one actually, a very big one. So I had to find her a cool gift. Um, so I went to the mall, 
I didn't I didn't know that the, the mall was still standing, but uh, the mall is still standing. It's it's very different from how I remember it, and uh, it was too late to uh, order something online, so I went to the mall, and that was uh, uh that was uh, that was also an experience. It's like. <clears throat> <laughs> it's like uh yeah it feels like the end of civilization you know everything is just getting going into the mall at least it feels like the end of civilization everything's just getting shitty uh most of the stores are uh most of the stores are are crap that no one needs like everybody is kind of dodgy there um and this is the nice mall in town mind you um but yeah, I found something nice. I found something nice. So, uh, so yeah, that's been my day. And now, we're, now we're gonna get to, now we're gonna get to experience some, uh, some, some sweet, sweet nostalgia. Um, I think let's go ahead and hop right in. I, I don't have too much to announce. I am doing a, uh, I'm doing a special, uh, very stupid Valentine's Day stream tomorrow. Uh, perfect date because a cat is fine too. And that is all I will say about that. Let's go ahead and hop right into Civ Three. We'll we'll talk about it a little bit while we uh, rock out to the uh, rock out to the to the main menu music here. Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah. Feel the circular breathing. Feel the circular breathing. Okay, that's probably a little loud. Let's bring you down. Okay. <laughs> Welcome to Sid Meier's Civilization 3. Um, I played this, uh, I played this right around when it came out in 2001. Um, I was not good at it. I was, uh, I was just the little horse and I didn't know, did not know what the fuck I was doing. So I'm actually kind of fascinated to come back to this game again, cause you know, I had it on CD and the CD got lost or broken or something, you know, somewhere along the way. So have not played this in probably 20 years. Um, so I'm kind of fascinated to see how this holds up. Get it, get it. This is not this is not the menu music I remember I remember but uh, I've been idling on the menu for a few minutes so maybe they start the uh, maybe they start the throat singing they start the throat singing a few minutes in I dig it though dig it though it's got the beat glorious 800 by 600 resolution yeah uh, so yeah yeah, I haven't played Civ 1 or 2. I only thing I know about Civ 1 is actually that uh that one guy who did like the 10 year long game like in real life, 10 10 years. Uh, and it stretched out into like what 5000 AD or something and the whole world was a nuclear wasteland. So, might be interested to check out uh, Civ 1 at some point. But this this is nostalgia for me. This is the first Civ game I played. And a lot of people say that Civ peaked here. A lot of people say that Civ peaked here. So, let's go ahead, start a new game. Yeah, I'm really, really very interested to see how this held up. Because, yeah, oh man. Oh man, yeah. Holy fuck, that's good. Holy fuck, that's good. <laughs> Um, should we enter a seed? Let's enter a seed. There we go. Yeah. Uh, so. We can, uh. We can make a few different choices here for, uh, for how we want our, uh, world to be. We could go completely random. We could not be a little bitch, and we could go completely random. Um, but Archipelago goes kind of a pain in the ass. Um. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Let's go. Let's let's keep it Earth-like. Let's keep it a continent, seventy percent water. Uh, I love. You can even control how old the planet is. Everything gets uh, flatter and more worn as uh, as as uh, as the days as the years go on. You know. Uh, yeah. We'll we'll 
We'll keep it, we'll keep it Earth-like, you know? We'll keep it Earth-like. We'll have it normal. We'll have it temperate. We'll have four billion years, you know? We'll, uh, we'll keep it Earth-like. And yeah, we have our magic seed there. Because it worked out so well for Valheim. This is the seed I used for Valheim and got, uh, got that amazing, uh, spawn. Sagier, not flatter. There you go. All right. So we have our uh, we have our civilization. Look, look, look at the look, 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 look at the animation. Oh yes, so good, so good. Fucking Mao. <laughs> okay, so each of them have two traits. Uh, each of the civilizations have two traits. So I think. Um, Militaristic and commercial. Yeah, let's uh, let's look at this. Let's look at this. Civilization strengths. Eight areas in which civilizations have natural strengths. Bismarck looks like Wilford Brimley. Yes, he does. One of my favorite parts about this game is that like they get different clothes uh, depending on uh, depending on which age they're in. So yeah, like if you look at Bismarck, he's got like Iron Age warlord going on. All right, so. Uh, eight areas in which civilizations have natural strengths. Each strength gives a civilization one free advance and one rules advantage. Okay. So agricultural, agricultural city improvements are easier to build. In the center city square, and irrigated deserts produce one more food. That's pretty strong. Commercial. The center city squares of all cities and metros produce extra commerce unless corruption is experienced. Sure. Expansionist. Starts the game with a scout. Can build more later. And passive minor barbarians are friendlier. Ah, okay, okay. Industrious. Workers complete tasks faster, and the city cent the center city square of all cities produces extra shields. Shields are the uh, units of, uh, of production, and if, if I recall, in cities and metros. Okay, so we beat our workers especially efficiently. Militaristic, easier to build military improvements, and combat experiences gain more quickly. Wonderful, wonderful. Uh, more. All right. Religious ex civilizations do not experience prolonged periods of anarchy during revolutions. That's right. That's right. If you want to change your government, you actually have to have a revolution and you go into anarchy for a few turns. I forgot about that. All right. Uh, scientific city improvements for the scientific are easier to build and the civilization receives a free civilization advance at the start of every era. That's strong. Seafaring. Each city built along the coast receives a commerce bonus in the center city square. Seafaring city improvements, such as the harbor or commercial dock, are easier to build. Ships move faster and are less likely to sink in the sea or ocean. Okay, okay. <laughs> oh, there's a difficulty above deity now? Sid. Okay. Um... All right, so I mean, obviously, obviously we're gonna go with Rome, right? But let's just, let's click through and see what else, let's see what else we've got. And if we're really interested in trying someone else, uh, I could maybe be persuaded to swerve from Rome. Yeah, we got Alexander looking, um, looking pretty cool. Yeah, Bismarck, I, I, I see where you're coming from with the Wilford Brimley. I definitely see that. Got Mr. Mao there. Cool hat, buddy. Tokugawa, also a cool hat. <laughs> uh, Gandhi looking like E.T. This is, um, yeah, this is like Gandhi post-hunger strike. Dear Lord. Yeah, I got Montezuma. Also a cool hat. Hiawatha, hello. <laughs> oh, okay, wow. Um, I don't remember you. I, the Mongols must have been like an expansion I didn't have or something. I do not remember you. You are, um, you look, uh, you look like someone who would, uh, who would shank me in the prison showers. Dear Lord. Penetrate me somehow, at least. Civ Gandhi is always fun. True. True. The commercial and religious. Uh. All right. Oh, we, hey, Ragnar Lovebrock. Let's go. Militaristic and seafaring. Oh, I like it. I like it. He's new as well. I, I, I did not have the expansion. I did not have the expansion. To be fair, Genghis absolutely is someone who would shank you. True. Very true. We've got the Celts. King Brennus of the Celts. Religious and agricultural. Interesting. Interesting mix. Got Carthage. General Hannibal of the Carthaginians. That's 
Very interesting they did not go with that with Dido or Dido, however you want to say it. Um, I know they went with her in later games. Uh, but yeah, there he is. There's Hannibal. Am I, am I just uh, coping, seething, and mauling about Canny? Perhaps. Got Sumeria? Oh, it's just Gilgamesh. Really? Really? You're going to do Gilgamesh? Alright, fine. I mean, he was probably real. Scientific and agriculture, that's strong. That's really strong, actually. Ooh. That's a good mix, scientific agricultural. <laughs> oh! <laughs> there he is! Got King William of the Dutch. Oh, nice outfit. Look at that hat. Look at that necklace. Fantastic. Got Theodora. Wonderful. Wonderful. Great instigator smoke jaguar of the Maya. <laughs> I mean... I might have to go with them just for that name, man. I want to be the great instigator. There's Cleopatra. She looks very Greek. They did a good job with her. They did a good job with her. You, uh, you must imagine Cleopatra Greek. And King Hammurabi. Yeah, all right. <laughs> okay, we we've got we have old Catherine the Great, not not young sexy Catherine the Great. Uh huh. Murica, got Lincoln. Okay. Expansionist and industrious. Yeah, that's a pretty good mix. France. Oh, I'm digging the helmet. Digging the helmet, Joan. Digging the helmet. Uh, commercial industrious. Uh, Xerxes. Also, so, is. Okay, no, no. No, Sumerians were scientific agricultural. Gotcha. Scientific industrious is a good mix, too. Got Shaka, the absolute bastard. Shaka and uh, Shaka and Tokugawa are like the two biggest bastards in this game, if I if I recall. Like they're just always constantly uh, constantly massing troops on your border and being a pain in the ass. Uh, England. I like <laughs> I like that they have. Um, I like that she's got pretty much Roman garb going on here. That's uh, appropriate for the time period, definitely. Oh, Spain. Queen Isabella of the Spanish, nice. They're just seafaring, eh, I guess. Yes, Osman, wonderful. Scientific and industrious. That's a good mix, that's a good mix. Abu Bakr, nice. He's, he also, um, <laughs> uh, he, um, hmm. I think, I think the temperature in Arabia is higher than his IQ. Um, the temperature at night. Wang Khan. Wang Khan of the Koreans. Commercial and scientific. Not bad, not bad. Got the Hittites. Yeah! The Hittites are new. King Merciless the Merciless. They got Portugal. Henry the Navigator. Wonderful. And the Inca. Sapa Inca. Pachacuti of the Inca. Wonderful. All right. What wimp? Civ 1 had Stalin? Fuck yeah! <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't think any of them have been spicy enough to uh, have uh, anyone other than Bismarck, the leader for Germany, though. Actually, Civ 4 had Frederick the Great or Bismarck. I think you could choose. Alright, um... If if I was gonna be real sweaty about it, I think I would probably go with uh, with the Sumerians. But uh, no, we'll we'll do a Rome game. We'll do a Rome game. Zip one had Frederick too. Nice. All right, and we'll play on Monarch. We'll play on Monarch. Uh, Monarch, if I recall, is uh, also had America, which lets you be Lincoln. Sure. Yeah, yeah, you have Lincoln in this game too. Um, yeah. Okay. Seven rivals. I like it. I like it. Alright. Yeah, we'll play a Rome game. Alright. 
It is the year 4000 BC. Your ancestors were nomads, but over the generations, your people have learned the secrets of farming, road building, and irrigation, and they are ready to settle down. Caesar, your people are militaristic and commercial and have recently mastered warrior code and alphabet. Uh-huh. Oh, get archer, bowman, javelin throwers. Very nice. Alphabet. Let's see, receives pottery is at second. Oh. The Kura. Okay, so we can get mathematics and writing from that. Very nice, very nice. Okay, the people have vested absolute power in you, trusting that you can build a civilization to stand the test of time. All right. Um, you know we've got a, we've got a very Roman, uh, got a very Roman setup here. I don't know how close we are to the ocean, but um, you know, got some mountains sort of far off. We're right on a right on a grand river, so uh, yeah, we will uh. Hey, yeah, okay, okay, I like it, I like it. Alright. Um, what do I want to do, what do I want to do? Probably... Fuck. <laughs> Shut up, dog. Um... I think probably the play is just to do barracks first, and that that'll make all of our uh, that'll make all of our military units better. So uh, yeah, I think we'll count on uh, no barbarians for a little while, and we'll do barracks first. All right. So uh, we can't automate the worker. Good, because uh, I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing. Uh, we're just gonna work. You know what? You you go about your tasks. You go about your tasks. Okay. Sir, our mystics need direction. Shall we look into the secrets of... Oh. Um... Let's see. The wheel would be good to have. New resource horses appear on the map. Well, we know what we're going for. Look into the wheel. Give me my horses, goddammit. What do we have? We've got tobacco! Let's go. Tobacco. Oh yeah, and then we have like the little little shields here. I guess this is just like representing mineral wealth, the little shields on the ground. Okay. Enter or space bar for the next turn. Okay. Nothing doing. Oh, okay. Okay. He's uh he's getting that pick in there. What are you working on? Order is in order to build mine. No, carry on. Hi, domestic advisor. Oh, we should meet the advisors. We should meet the advisors. Wait, okay. Can I drag or... Oh, it's inverted. That's... Okay. So we don't drag, we... Alright. Let's meet the advisors. Alright. These, these people are, uh... <laughs> These people are, they're special. They're very special. No, I like, the, they, they have a lot more personality than uh, than the advisors in, uh, in the other games, in the later games. Rome is growing slowly, Supreme Lord. Yeah, well, you know. Yeah, no. Okay, so we have income five, expenses three. We have our trade advisor. We have absolutely no resources to trade. We should acquire some as soon as possible before they are monopolized by others. Yeah, okay, so, yeah, it's sad faces from the trade advisor. Yeah! We could support a larger military, yeah. Get that, get that military industrial complex going, goddammit. Make more friends. You can't, you can't make me make friends. You can't make me talk to people. No matter what you say, you can't make me talk to people. All right. If we study the arts, we can build great intellectual wonders, spreading our influence and culture. All right, sure. Our scientific research is barely adequate. Please increase science funding. God damn it. Of all the leaders they could have picked for America, let you be Lincoln. Uh-oh. 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 Oh, okay, it's the Maya. Hi there. The Mayan military forces outnumber us. That's not good. The Mayan people are technologically advanced. 
All right. Behold the native mightiness of Smoke Jaguar. I, from the noble lands of the Mayan, greet you with fresh water to quench away the dust and a jaguar pelt. Treat fair with me in mind, and I will spare you the pain of my powerful teeth. Um... Tell you what. Can we do a, can we do a cultural exchange here? Caesar, surely you can spare a bit more. We are so close to agreeing. Uh, how about you fuck off? Goodbye, Smoke Jaguar. All right, great one. I like uh, th these people show proper deference. At least I uh, I appreciate this. All right, let's make a let's make an archer. Supreme Lord, the borders of Rome expand because of its high culture. Wonderful. All right. Oh oh, we have a village. Fuck, smoke jaguar is gonna get there first. Damn it. That is unfortunate. We have furs though. We have furs and we have tobacco. Yeah. Lee, maybe Jackson. Uh, wrong America, I think. Uh, wrong America. Look at him go. He's building a road, I guess? Okay. Now Smoke Jaguar won't fuck with me. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll put out another archer, and then we'll probably do a settler. Um. Yeah. Oh, hey. We have gems in the mountains. This... Okay, so that's more of a puddle than an ocean. This might be the ocean, though. Civil disorder in Rome. Oh, uh, well. We were... We were so close to greatness. All right. Um, alright, so I think, why don't you go over and, uh, the Sarmatian tribe has taught us ceremonial burial. Wonderful. Why don't you go over and, uh, okay, so people are pissed off for reasons, I guess. Content labor, why, why? It's just way too crowded. Okay. Do you want I should kill some of you then? Uh, make it a little less crowded? You better get to work. You're building a mine in farmland? Yeah, apparently so. Apparently so. That's what the worker wanted to do. Maybe this was why I always lost uh, the Civ games, because I always automated the workers. Okay, can you... Okay. So what, do you need to irrigate it? Probably. Oh god. Wow, we started really close to Smoke Jaguar there. Yeah, yeah. Okay, there's there's got to be something I can do here. Um, can I can I get some bread and circuses going here? Can I get some bread and circuses going here? Um. Okay, there must be a way. I think. Ah, yes. Yeah, I can get some bread and circuses going. Wonderful. Okay, can you can you like. Okay. Wow. Wow. Okay. All right. So you know what? We're 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 spending we're spending some cash on some bread and circuses here. That's fine. That's fine. Hey, who are you? Who are you? Whoa! whoa, whoa. There, oh, it was, okay, it was the Americans. The American military has the warrior. I have, I have pointy sticks that I can shoot at them, though. Lincoln offers pottery. Lincoln wants warrior code. Uh, should we teach, should we teach those bastard Americans how to fight honorably? Uh, it, w it would be a first. We accept your offer. Give us pottery. On behalf of the people of America, I thank you and all the Roman people. All right. Um... What else you got? You have bronze working as well. Oh. Um. You accept this? Must decline your offer in its entirety. Okay. Um. How about that? That dog won't hunt. We'll take it. All right. That works. Okay. 
Okay, so we will, uh, we'll have the Archer Garrison room here. Just in case some, uh, some barbarians get, get any ideas, you know. Uh, mysticism. What do I get from mysticism? Allows you to build the Oracle. Or oh, you can do polytheism. Alright, sure. Why not do religion? Oh, shit. And then I was, uh... Oh, you know what? Yeah, sure. We'll build up a little bit more. What could go wrong with expanding the military, you know? What could go wrong? Is this is this America? Oh, oh, okay. Hey, hey, hey. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, fuck you. Veteran archers now elite. All right. Get him. Get him. So I think if you take down the camp, you get a uh, you get get much good stuff. Yeah, twenty five gold. Screw your barbarian. The people love you. The people love you. It's that easy. It's that easy. It's that easy. A glorious triumph against the barbarians. They admire your achievements so much they offer to expand your palace. This is this is something that went away in the later games, but I love it. Move a mouse around to highlight sections of your palace that you may improve. Click on a section to build it. Oh, okay. So I can do some landscaping. I can make some cool stairs. And get like a nice little facade. And those are my options. All right. So yeah, we could go. Yeah, do like gothic, like a Incan Mayan sort of thing. Then I think this is the. Uh, this is like the Mediterranean, uh, Greco-Roman style, so we'll definitely stick with that. Um, you know what, why not do landscaping first? I like it. Alright, um... Yeah, keep exploring. We'll have, uh, Mr. Spearman explore as well, and... Okay, time to expand. Time to expand. So we will throw out a settler. I think think what I'll probably do is have the settler go over there near where the gold is. Oh, that's um that's a large number of barbarians. You gonna be okay, buddy? Yeah, you're fine. You're fine. Okay. Um, probably time to leave, though. Probably time to leave. All right. Let's uh, let's have you come back to uh, let's have you come back to base here. Oh, for fuck's sake! Thucydides has completed his great history of the world, the most advanced nations of the world, the glorious Inca, the great Iroquois, the fine Americans, the mediocre Aztecs, the puny Germans, the pathetic Zulu, the hopeless Maya, and the forgotten Romans. Uh, no, I don't like that. Alright, um, I think if I go over there, what the hell are you? Ouch. Yeah, seriously. Seriously, ouch. Alright. So, yeah. I'm thinking... Yeah, probably head over... Head over in this direction and, uh... Maybe get... Yeah, maybe get set up, like, right about there. Okay, you better... You guys better not cut me off here. Uh, yeah, I'm thinking like right there in that forest might be a decent place for a city. So we'll have, yeah, we'll have access to the gold. We got some nice, uh, got some shields we can build mines on, even though it's grassland that should probably be irrigated, but yeah, no. Alright. No, okay. We're, we're, we're doing pretty good on the uh, military front. In fact, uh... Alright. Say, um, you know what, we'll, uh, bolus. Wonderful. 
Ah, yes. Oh, we can build the Colossus if we if we so choose. What does the Kura do? Um, probably not a terrible idea. Honestly, granaries are probably the way to go. I think granaries improve your food supply. You know, as 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 one would expect, as one would expect. Um, yeah. Alright, and let's have you... Assuming our archer dude gets back, uh, gets back, we'll probably have him garrison, uh, Hyenopolis here. And why don't, yeah, Mr. Spearman, why don't you go check out, uh check out our immediate surroundings here. Forest harvested 10 shields return to Rome. Okay, sure. Sure, that's something you could do. Hmm. I feel like I'm gonna need to kill the Mayans sooner rather than later. Um... They're very advanced, though. It's a little bit scary. Oh, boy. Okay. Yeah. Yep. 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 Please. 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 Please, I beg you. Please, I beg you. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Okay. 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 Let me. Let me fucking move. Let me fucking move. Okay, yes, you, and then you, I want to control you as well. Alright, Rome produce a granary, what does that do exactly? Effectively doubles the rate of a city's growth by causing only half of a city's food store to be depleted when the city grows. Yeah, very nice, very nice, very nice, that's good shit. Uh, what does a temple do? Produces one content face, making one unhappy citizen content. Okay, yes, we should probably do that. We should probably do that, because these, uh... These citizens begin moody. All right. Uh, can you just fortify here? Oh, you get health back when you fortify. Nice. I forgot that happened. Beautiful. <laughs> All right. Beat their asses. Let's go. Uh huh. So you lost no health. Uh, probably because he was on a, a mountain. We'll uh, we'll blame the um, we'll blame the rough terrain. All right. Then yes, you can go garrison Hyenopolis. All right. Um, probably yeah. Probably want to throw a third city out uh, right there. We've got a got a lot of good fish. So uh, this is good. We appear to be at uh, we appear to be at the northern end of a continent though. And that's uh, that's not a bad place to be. It's not a bad place to be. Go kick their asses. Alright. So yeah, once Rome builds its temple, I'll probably... Probably do another, uh, settler. Yeah, fuck your barbarian. Workers have completed a road to bring furs into Rome. Oh, that's right. Right, you have to make roads. You have to make roads to the luxuries. Shit. Alright, um. Can we do iron working? Do we have any iron? Maybe the iron will show up. I hope the iron will show up. Come on. Come on, you can do it. 
You can do it. Okay, yeah. Can I... Can I do like... Well, no, 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 no. I just want to... Maybe the arrow keys? Can the arrow keys? Okay, yeah, the arrow keys. Arrow keys can be used. Fair enough. All right. Yeah, food, one gold. Yeah, so we'll probably do... Yeah, we'll do our... Uh, we'll, we'll have like a very... Uh, we'll have a very naval city, you know? We love the Emperor Day celebrated. As well they should. Yeah. Admire your achievements so much they offer to expand your palace. Okay. Ah, uh, sure. Let's do that. Looking good. Looking good. Okay, so yeah, we are definitely on the northern end of the continent, which is which is helpful. We only ever have to really worry about uh getting attacked from one direction here. Holy shit. Okay, so. Yeah, let's have you go over there. Ah! A Minoan encampment. Screw those Minoans. Okay, so. Yeah. Yeah, we we could should we work on the oracle or should we build up like a should we build up a strike force and take on the Mayans? I think I don't hate the idea of building the oracle. Happiest nations of the world. Yeah, yeah, we are we're stupid but we're happy. Getting attacked by one direction sounds pr plenty bad. Yep. Yeah, I'm not saying it's the ideal situation, but, you know. Great Inca, fine Americans, okay. Okay, so the Maya are, uh, are very unhappy. Maybe we can use that against them. What does what Akura do? I'm assuming Akura is like a work boat. That's what you need to... Let's see. Can, can you tell me... Is there something I can click to, uh... No, Kura looks like a military unit. I think, think there is a, uh... I think there is... Alright, here. Let's just, let's have you build a granary. Build a granary to start with, you know? Alright. So, all right. So yeah, we will start building up our grand army to deal with the Incans here. All right, build a road. And then, yeah, I think I fucked up. Let's see if this connects, uh... Alright. Citizens in Rome are happy. That's good, because I'm about to do something that'll make them a little unhappy. Okay. I don't think there will be civil disorder. like local okay so so I guess just making a uh, road to uh, just making a road to the tobacco did not work um, let's actually yeah let's have you let's have you the Americans have requested an audience will you see them sure uh, Lincoln offers masonry. Lincoln wants 140 gold. Uh, 
American people are wise and generous. Will you accept this extremely fair trade of knowledge? Uh, I'm not really making any money, but yeah. The Mayan city of Chichen Itza has completed a great project, the pyramids. Cusco completed the statue of Zeus. Okay. Take it. Yeah. Yeah, early tech is usually uh, usually a good idea. Alright. Um Yeah, let's uh Alright. Let me find out where those barbarians are coming from. Yeah, we'll build a road to the furs. If we can get the furs, uh, then we can trade them with other people. Like if we have two sources of it. Because you only ever need one, and then your entire empire is happy. Um, writing would be a good idea. Writing would be a good idea. First, an Anasazi encampment took 25 gold. Oh, are you are you getting right up in my grill? Okay. Yeah. It's it's time. It's time. Look at this bastard settling, like, right here. Oh, yeah. It's time. It's time. All right. You absolute son of a bitch. Okay, so someone beat us to the oracle. Oh, boy. Production has been switched to Settler. No. No. Are you aware that switching to Archer will waste 10 shields? Uh, let's see. What? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let it be so. Man, everyone is getting the jump on you. No, you have no wonders to build. Yeah, pretty much. I could still build the Colossus, I think, on uh, in one of my coastal cities. Unfortunately, my coastal cities uh, fucking suck. So, uh, so yeah. All right. But you know what? I think uh, I think the Maya made one of the uh, one of the wonders. So we, maybe we'll just go take that one. How's that sound? Maybe we just go and take that one. Maybe we just go and take that one. Alright. Very nice. Um, yeah, build barracks so you can contribute. Aha! So the Mayans have the Colossus as well. Yeah, these are, uh, these are seeming like exactly the kind of people we want to rip off. My army fears our archer. My military forces outnumber us, are technologically advanced. Uh-huh. 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 Oh. You need to connect your cities. Yes. Yes, I do. Uh, that's, uh, that's a big wealth generator. Take, take your empty threats elsewhere, Smoke Jaguar. Yeah. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Okay, that, that went poorly. I think terrain really does matter. Terrain really does matter here. Alright, let's have you... Um, horseback riding. Now that we can write, we can establish embassies with our neighbors. Let's do it. Um, oh wow, espionage. Uh, sure, build an embassy. All right, yeah, you build a you build a boat, you build a boat. We'll attack them with our boats. 
Hey, is that iron? That is iron. Okay, well, we definitely need to we definitely need to take out the Mayans now. All right. Um I think archers are better for uh, offensive operations, so Oh, they have What the hell are you? A javelin thrower. That's not good. Holy shit. Okay, so we really are uh, really not having a whole lot of luck, luck taking these uh, fortified positions. Fair enough. Now he's moving, though. Now he's moving. Now he's moving. Alright. Let's wait for them to... Uh, let's wait for them to get, uh, get out of the mountains here. Or hell, we can... Uh, yeah. We can even fortify our dudes in the mountains. Alright. Seriously? Alright. Well, surely, surely, surely this dude can, uh, can take him down. Very nice. Veteran Spearman, it's now elite. Oh, you are not, you are not actively colonizing. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Okay. Need to, we need to block this fucker. Treacherous Maya and the evil Americans have declared war on us. They have a military alliance to destroy us. Eh, to no one's great surprise. Yes, I can, and don't call me Shirley. Oh, probably should have softened this guy up with... Nice! Alright. You're mine. Go do humiliating menial tasks. Alright, um... All right. We'll wake up the uh, archer. Oh, no, 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 not what I wanted you to do. All right. He's on flat land. We should be able to win. Okay, well, never mind. Never mind. Stone axe! How the A Warrior's Dynamite Okay. Things could be going better. Things could be going better. But things could be going worse. Alright, um, yeah, show what you can do. Show what you can do. We'll do a daring naval raid on this nerd. And yeah, okay, I can't... St I can stack up, uh... Oh, 
Got him. Nice. Okay, yeah. I think the spearmen are better suited for defense, so we'll, uh... Yeah. Only ground units can be used to attack settlements. Okay, so what can you do? What can you do? No, oh, that, that does not favor him. That does not favor him. Very nice, very nice. Yeah, people love you. A glorious military victory. Okay. Um, all right, my dude. Yeah, get back into the city. We'll have you fortify there. All right, so... So the boat's pretty worthless unless uh, the enemy has boats. I guess. Uh-huh. Oh, now they're pillaging. Now they're pillaging. Well, hopefully it... They're not doing anything else. Um, alright. No, 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 no. Cycle units. Oh, here we go. Alright. Wake Elite Archer. Christ, man. Okay. Okay, now the now the Americans are getting involved. Wonderful. Okay, yeah. They shouldn't be able to do much with the warriors. Um Learn the secrets of horseback riding. Cool. If only we had horse. If only we had horses, that would be nice. That would be nice if we had some horses. Uh, mathematics. Do you give me something cool? Give me catapults. Fuck yeah. Well, the people are happy at least. Yeah, let's build some cool columns. Cavalry. Yep. Here's hoping. All right. Okay, so yeah, I want to uh, want to start producing more uh, more archers than spearmen if we're going to be going on the offensive here. Then again, I don't know that we are going to be going on the offensive here. Um, like the thought, like the thought, build a barracks first so the units don't suck. More iron up in those hills. Yeah, hopefully we get to exploit it at some point. Yeah, I see the uh, see the iron there. Gotcha. So the archers get a little cheap shot in if they attack you. That's very nice. That's very nice. Right. Can I? All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Uh. Naval warfare not going great for us, but, uh, you know. Okay. Holy shit, you suck. 
Okay, this is a problem. This is a problem, actually. We're gonna... This is a problem. Yeah, they're probably gonna be able to take this city. Ooh, yeah, that's a problem. That's a problem. Okay. Yeah, keep working on the archers, then. Very nice. Okay, so the Americans have cavalry, and that's a big problem. Our treasury is running dangerously low. Well, well, uh, cut the science budget. There we go. So you're going to pick for your next try. Uh, you know, the Sumerians were looking pretty swagging. Okay. Oh, okay. And the Americans appear to have, uh, have swordsmen as well. That is also a big problem. That is a big problem. All right, we need to try and get a we need to try and get an archer and maybe another spearman over to uh, over to the other city there. Oh. Fortify. So I assume, I assume my dude gets, uh, my spearmen get a little bit of a bonus against the, uh, against the horsemen. That is usually how it works. So let's give it a try. Very nice. Okay, okay, look at this guy. Look at this guy. Okay, this is uh this is not a great situation here. Uh yeah, I don't think we're uh, I don't think we're getting through. I don't think we're getting through to the other uh, city there. And Rome burns, yeah. Jeez. What a bunch of cowards. What a bunch of cowards. Seriously? Couldn't have at least taken one with you? Alright. Yeah, that's a problem. The, the swordsman is a problem. Okay. We do still have the means to make this very painful for them, though. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, we'll, uh... We'll try and get the civil disorder sorted. Oh, that's just fucking cheeky there. Who the fuck... That, that's not even the... Who the fuck are you? The Inca? Oh, no, that's Aztecs. Uh, 
All right. Um. Very nice. Really? Okay. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. Alright. Oh, what a shitter. Okay, so the javelin throwers are not, uh, javelin throwers are kind of a pain in the ass, frankly. A massive barbarian uprising near Rome. Cool, maybe they'll kill some of the enemies. Larger land must will give you more time to develop. True. Are you fucking serious? Alright. So how many archers do we have? We have a good number of archers. Um, we're going to try to break out here. Look at all that beautiful cavalry. Too bad it's theirs. Exactly. Yeah. Too bad it's theirs. Yeah, we are going to use the archers to, uh, yeah, kind of undermine them if we can. Very nice. Alright, yep, we'll kill you. Easy. Um, yep. Veteran Archer. Take on this nerd. Ooh. I don't like that he's elite though. That's that's that might be a problem, yeah. Alright, yeah, come on, get that shit back. Oh fine. There we go. That took a little bit of doing. Come on. You're a spearman. You should have some uh you should have some advantage against cavalry. Okay. Okay, okay, I see how it is. Oh shit, we're out of spearmen. That's a problem. Rename this victorious unit. <laughs> I don't think it's gonna matter. Elite Star Archer. Okay. Activate Trajan. No, 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 no. We are not. We are not disbanding. We're not disbanding anything. What does Trajan do? Trajan, what do you do? What's your deal? What's your deal?
I think maybe Trajan helps with, uh... Maybe Trajan helps us with, uh... Gives us a little bit of a buff to our, uh, to our military here. At least if he does what, uh, what the great generals do in the, uh, in Civ 5 and Civ 6. So yeah, for next time, need to expend a, need to expand a lot more aggressively. Definitely need to expand a lot more aggressively. All right. Um. Let's have you do Spearman instead. Yeah, that's not a good. That's not a good matchup. That's not a good matchup. Uh huh. You have suffered a humiliating conquest loss. <laughs> and this this screen this screen is one I have seen many times before. Fuck the Mayans, seriously. Go back to Chieftain. Yeah, that's, uh, that's probably good advice. Probably good advice. Probably good advice. Don't worry, champ, you'll get him next time. Uh-huh. <laughs> Alright, so yeah. Might turn the difficulty down a little bit, and yeah, just need to expand a lot more aggressively uh, in the very early game. Okay, uh, we gonna... Uh oh it might have frozen. It might have frozen. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> yep. Okay. Uh, well. Give me, uh, give me one moment here. I'm gonna restart the uh, program and uh, I'll be right back. We are back. Uh, you know you can pick your enemies. A punishment for failure. That's that's about right. Um, yeah, you can. You can. Let's go ahead and play the last world. I wanna... It's that damn seed. I know it is. I know it is. Okay. We'll, we'll, we'll turn the difficulty down a little bit and... Sumeria looked kind of interesting. Um, I'm actually a little, little unsure. Can build Enkidu warriors instead of warriors. They also cannot build spearmen. Interesting. Uh, so yeah. Scientific research labs you to build. Civilization receives a free civilization advance at the start of every era. There's only like uh, four eras, so maybe that's not as strong as I think it is. Um, France is actually France actually seems pretty strong. Commercial and industrious are both pretty good. Um, this is actually a nice uh, this is actually a nice balance too. So I think you get extra happiness from uh, religion if you're religious. Give us Sumerians. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, Yeni. We'll give you Sumerians. Sure thing. Sure thing. All right. And we'll make everyone random again. 
What about the Celts? Ooh, yeah. Okay, so I got this. Oh, I got the same start. Okay. So, yeah. So, we're working with exactly the same start. Got Ur, Ur, Dagoth, Enkidu Warrior. Um, yeah, let's. We'll start with a warrior and then we'll do a settler immediately. Alright. Ceremonial burial. Let's just do temple, uh, which is a really important one. We'll grab that. Okay. So immediately have uh, have Enkidu fortify there, and then yeah, I think we will uh, go ahead and do a settler right away. And why don't you go pick up that village while we still have time? Castle like Tribe taught us warrior code. Beautiful. All right. I think, like, my choices for where to build the cities were solid, I think. Uh, just make sure there aren't any barbarians lurking, like, right there. Fair enough. All right. And then we'll go, yeah, go over there. Gold! Hell yeah. Yeah. Okay, we got ceremonial burial. Let's get a... Uh, what does masonry give us, actually? It allows pyramids! Palace walls, or an outpost. What does an outpost do? Eliminate fog of war. Interesting. Range of vision for the outpost. Two tiles on flat terrain, three on hills, and four on mountains. That's interesting. If an outpost falls within the territory of any other civilization, it will be destroyed. Okay. Um, let's go with Alphabet. I've, um, played this a few times. Yeah. Yeah, no, this is, uh, this is the same seed. This is the same map. We have the same start. So, uh, I, I have a pretty good idea of what we're looking at. We're once again on the northern part of the continent. Um... All right, so we have Americans, Inc we have the Inca, we have the Sumerians, Iroquois, Aztec, Hittites, got the Maya, and the Greeks. Okay. Um, all right, we'll have you fortify, and why don't you build a granary now? Sumer. Um, yeah, we'll go with the granary first. Go with granary first. And the people love you. Sure, we'll go with that. Very pretty. Okay. So yeah, we need to need to get some sailing tech to make the coastal cities worth it, but I think they will be very worth it there near the end. And ideally, I'd like to get further south before uh, before our rivals do. So maybe, yeah. All right, we will. Uh, let's go ahead and build a temple. That's a problem. Alright. Just gonna retreat them back to our territory. I don't know if that makes a difference for how much health they regen when they fortify or not. But just in case, we'll, uh, we'll retreat them back. I thought I told you to do the wheel. Fine. Um, yeah, let's get another settler going. Kamaya 
Hittites. <laughs> okay, I assume powerful means like military power, so once again, we don't have enough. We don't have enough. So I need to be, I need to be spamming military pretty much. Oh, there they are. There they are. Okay. Okay, it's the Americans. You know what? You know what? You know what? I'm still a little salty about what you did last time around, so, uh, we're gonna make a barracks. We're gonna make a barracks! I think we're coming for you, motherfuckers. Civil Disorder and Sumer. Okay. Let's uh, make with the happy here. Oh, I think having a garrison might help with the Civil Disorder, too. If I recall... Barracks. Alright. Yeah, just start spewing out archers and ankadoos. Well, gosh, wonderful. Alright, we'll have you do a granary. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's right. Having a garrison helps with uh, civil disorder. Um, iron working. Yeah, let's do that. Because we know there's, we know there's iron deposits nearby. Can I... Can I, like, can I queue things? That would be nice. Incinerate them before they grow stronger. Correct. That's the plan. Oh yeah, look at these bastards. Look at these absolute bastards. Okay, yep. Time to go. Time to go. No, we're not building the Oracle. Only prophecy I need is that we're gonna kick them some American ass here. That's the only prophecy I need. Alright. So yeah. Um, let's actually have you go back and be a garrison. So I think mostly we're going to want to take with the uh, archers. So yeah, we have, we have Ankidus. Oh no. All right. So we'll send the next Ankidu over to be a garrison for Lagash here. Nope, nope, nope. We are just spewing them out. Uh-huh. I see what you're trying. I see what you're trying. All right. If we take them by surprise, we've probably got enough here. And hopefully we can sort of catch them off balance and, uh... And kill them all! Alright. Let's have you go down and kind of protect this flank. Okay, they have a spearman on it. Alright. 
Wake you. Wake you. Wakey, wakey. for the last thank you do to get there. All right. <laughs> Let us destroy them, sir. You're right. They are scum. All right. Not, not letting this bullshit happen again. Okay. Wake up. Wake up. Everybody wake. Wakey, wakey, wakey. Okay, iron, yep, there's the iron showing up on the map, so, very nice, very nice. Let's see, yep, they've got a spearman on there. wonder if, is that all they've got? That might be all they, they've got, okay. Yep, that's all they got. Or is it? No, they have more, okay. Alright, Enkidu. Enki, Enkidu, where are you? Beautiful. Our great civilization has entered a golden age. Yeah! Supreme Lord, once again our magnificent armies are victorious. We have destroyed Philadelphia and liberated six gold. Beautiful. I mean, it's, it's just good sense to do that to Philadelphia. Don't give it a chance. All right, Anki Anki do. Get on down there. All right. If I recall, this turns into like flatlands past these mountains, so we'll have a much easier time fighting uh, fighting the rest of them. Beautiful, beautiful. We have destroyed Chicago. Alright. So yeah, you fortify, get your health back. Okay, um, yeah, do barracks. The barbs are gonna be an issue. Very nice. A carob encampment, nice. Okay. So we'll have you fortify. Meanwhile, he's had some time to build up an army. There's, there's gonna be some shit waiting for us once we get over this mountain range. Should have conquered them. I don't have an option. Uh, they just, I think if it's just a one size city, it just gets raised. Because uh, it, it loses, uh, I think it loses population no matter what when you take it. So yeah, I think if it's a one size city, it just gets raised. I did not have the option to, uh, to conquer or raise it. Yeah, I would have, I would have liked to keep them and just, you know, spare myself the settlers, but oh well. The 
glorious Sumerians, the wealthiest nation in the world, of course. Uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's actually do a... Let's do another settler here real quick. And yeah, probably get them... Get them down right around here. Actually, get them down so we can get uh, access to that iron resource. Yeah. That's the play. Okay, this is feeling like their capital. Just the size of the uh, the ring around it here. Feels like the capital, probably. Keep on rolling here. Yeah, this is this has got to be the capital, right? Okay. Right. Oh, and they. Olm oh, okay. These are just barbarians. All right. Uh, do we attack? Uh, they're on a mountain tile, though. Um, I might divert. Might divert that archer and that Ankydu. Gotta mind that golden build roads connect your city. Correct, yes. Yeah, I think I'm gonna take this guy off of uh, automation and maybe I'll build an additional, uh, probably will build an additional, yeah. In fact, let's get another, wor let's get another worker going here. Yeah, I think you're right, connect the cities. Cause if I recall, you get like some pretty serious commerce if you have all the cities connected. All right. So yeah, I think what we're going to do with that American Spearman and Settler trying to break off and uh, settle a new city is just try and intercept them. Um, and then yes, we will probably, yeah, go like right about there. Found a new city, that way we get the gems, we get the iron. Alright, where, which one are we talking about here? Okay. Washington. Okay. So yes, this is their capital. Um, let's go ahead and uh, try to surround it if we can. As close as we can get to surrounding it, at least. Resources are shared by all- Ah, okay, so... Gotcha, so connect the cities, then uh, everybody gets furs, and, uh, yeah. And whatevs. Okay. Uh, yeah. Well, we just got that new, uh, just got that new worker. Um, yeah, let's... Go ahead and have you, uh, have you build a road for us. Alright, come on. All right, um, how we doing? How we doing? We've got, we've got three archers. I said, yeah, okay, so they do have an archer on top of it. They did not build a barracks, though, so that's nice. Very good, okay. Yeah, I should have figured we'd have crap tons of, uh, crap tons of spearmen. Alright, um, yeah, let's... Okay, well, that's the thing you can do. Barracks, yeah. Uh, we want to play this. 
this. Got, got an archer here. Probably have that archer attack. Okay, this one isn't even fortified. This has got to be the last one, right? I think just tunnel vision and take the city. Yeah! Great. Install a new governor. Supreme Lord, there's one resistor in Washington. We should garrison Washington with strong units to call the stinking resistance. Yeah. Yeah. Cry about it. Cry about it. Uh, let's let's build a temple, you know, indoctrinate them into our uh, into our way of life. Okay, so they're not dead yet, which means there's more. Uh, let's have you go inside the city, actually. Um, yeah, we'll send send Anki Anki Do to handle that. Okay, that's the, uh... Hell yeah! Absolutely. Okay. So, uh, okay. I see, I see the, I see the borders of the new one already. All right. I think we can uh think we can lay back on uh probably lay back on military production at least a little bit. Uh let's should we build the pyramids. Sure, let's try and build the pyramids. Resistance in Washington has ended. Wonderful. All right, we, uh, are you on, man, he just keeps, keeps moving to mountain tiles. That's really freaking annoying. Um, I don't have any way to block his path now, so, god damn it. Yeah, we're, we're, gotta throw at least one away here. Maybe two. Maybe two. Oh, fuck me. Okay. Yeah. Okay, we're just gonna have everyone turtle on Washington here for a sec. Okay, are those barbarians? No, those are America. Okay. Alright. Come on, get it! Damn it! Alright. You must not fuck this up, at least. There we go. Alright. Got the settler. Wonderful. Alright. Um. Well, since we have, uh. Since they already began work on the roads, I figure. Ooh, can we do roads over mountains yet? We might not be able to do a road over the mountain. Let's see. Oh, no. He can. All right. Go ahead and automate. All right. Um, all right. Let's see. Yeah, we'll wake the archers here. Anki, Anki, do. Here go you. All right. Yeah. Very nice. Um, and we want you to grow very quickly. I might have you build. No, no. We'll we'll have you go granary first. Probably temple right after that so that its boundaries expand fast. 
I think temples give you culture in this game. Okay, that's, that's a lot of barbarians. That's kind of a problem. Very good. Um, do I really want to engage them in the forest there? Uh, yeah. We'll risk it. We'll risk it for the biscuit here. Very nice. Beautiful. Alright. Um, yeah, I don't think the horseman can reach that spot. We'll see. Oh, yes he can. Yes he can! <laughs> Alright. Well, go get revenge, Anki Anki Do. That really sucks. <laughs> that really, really sucks. Okay. Let's call up the archer here. I'm hoping this is their last city. Yeah, just fortify. You've already moved. Okay. Yeah, you need to figure out what the deal is with these barbs. Nice. Very smooth. Well, that's embarrassing. Oh, I see. It just takes forever to build roads through the mountains. Uh, you know, realistic. Realistic. Oh. Oh, Atlanta. Imagine your last bastion of resistance being Atlanta. Just, uh... Just kind of sad. All right. If we get lucky. Oh, we're not. We're not getting lucky on this one. And there's more than uh, more than one of them. Of course there are. Perhaps I ceased military production too early. Good news is the uh, the other cities are gonna have military production online here pretty soon. Great, and now it's a veteran. Of course it is. Um, all right, there are horses around here somewhere. All right, let's let's take a look around and see what we've got. Uh huh. Bunch of swamps, bunch of forests. Not to be a nuge, but you don't get the benefits of that gold till you uh, road and mine it. Gotcha. I, I yeah, that makes sense. So we will, uh, yeah, we'll be in a good position to mine it after uh, after we're done there. Thank you. Do I get anything from like the city ruins? Yeah, they're just planes. No, no, no. If, if, if people know about this game, uh, like I said, it's been probably 20 years since I played this, so, uh. So where's Produce Barracks? Wonderful, wonderful. Let's, uh. Yeah, why don't you, why don't you go ahead and make an archer? Alright, we'll probably, well, if we can clear those barbarians, we'll probably do another city like here.
Sumera's not growing. Alright. This isn't even their capital. Oh, hello. What's your deal? Aztecs. Montezuma of the Aztecs has noticed your cute little civilization. Uh-huh. Our people are dismissive of the Aztec cultural achievements. Aztec military has the spearman. Uh-huh. They're impressed with our culture, our scientific equals. All right. Well, um... This is... Yeah, that's... You're not going to take that trade. Uh, writing is more advanced than ceremonial burial. Um, okay. Good to know. Good to know. You have horses, though. Okay. So yeah, we really need to track down some horses here. Those are, yeah, those are deer game. Oh yeah, I remember this track. This track goes hard. Seriously? Alright. Alright, give us another archer then. Um, alright, we're gonna have to get insanely lucky to take this guy down first try, but let's see. Very nice. Very nice. Yeah, you deserve to be elite. That was... That was pretty damn elite. Alright. Anki Anki Doo, where are you? Uh, no Anki snack for you. No Anki snacks for you. There we go. This guy gets an Anki snack. We have destroyed Atlanta and liberated eight gold. Alright. Oh, okay. There he is. Alright. I'm gonna have you go back. Oh, yeah. That's a lot of workers. Very nice. Our civilization's golden age has ended, so say our analysts. Oh, well. Immediately they start rioting. Alright, um, probably then. Ooh. We are just, uh... Um... I got 249 gold. I could operate at a loss, I guess. I guess. Well, that'll get Washington out of civil disorder, too. Alright, well, let's have uh, this worker start on, uh, yeah, getting a road back to our capital. Uh, we might... Yeah... Yeah, I see what you're trying. Alright, so yeah. Do the mine, and then we'll have some gold, and that'll make people happier. Because, yeah. Sumer and Ur are connected now, so Sumer should be happier. Back riding, baby. Alright. You have a bonus to being on the offensive, so yeah, this should go well for you. Oh, that was a much closer thing than I had hoped. 
Alright, yeah, you start on the road. You help on the road. Oh, and now Lagash is helping. Okay. We really need to not give the Americans any room to breathe here, so... Let's roll up on them. And yeah, we can thank you do. They probably already have two cities here from the look of it. Yep. The Americans have requested an audience. Oh, are you going to cry? You going to shit your pants maybe? Um, what are you offering? War is getting us nowhere. Let us end it now. Here are our terms. What do you say? Uh, goodbye. That's what I say. I say goodbye. Okay, so we got screwed out of the pyramids. Lovely. Alright. Alright. Hey. Hey, dumbass. Hey, dumbass, you're gonna die. Yeah, okay. No wonders for me. Let's wake up Enkidu again, and, uh, can you, uh, oh, 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 that's really bad. Oh, that's not, that's really, that's really bad, that's not good. Uh, alright, evacuate the city. I think if a barbarian takes the city, he just sacks it. Yeah, our work on temple has been destroyed, yeah. Does he fuck off? He fucks off. At least there's that. Alright. We'll, uh... We'll just have Anki Anki do, uh... Chill for a little while. Wait for reinforcements. Alright. Yeah, this would be a good place to settle. This would be a good place to settle. Actually, we could, uh, could go down there and get access to the dyes, or, you know, there's the gems there. Yeah, I might, uh, might rebuild on the ruins of Lost Atlanta there. The sunken city of Atlanta. Actually, you know what? Let's... Yeah, let's have you just go down. Let's have you just go down here and... We'll get those furs under control. I have you fortify. You really don't want to build a city in a jungle. Oh, is that a jungle? That is a jungle, isn't it? Oh, yeah, look how shitty that is. Yeah, huh. 
Well, maybe we can, uh... Yeah, let me do a little bit of scouting there and see if maybe we can do something, like, on the coast. If it stays jungle all the way to the coast, and then, yeah, maybe we can, uh... So what is this? It's tropical fruit. Okay. Might be worth having. Alright, uh, yeah. Roads. Come on down. Um, I guess I could try to get a road to Kish. Then it would get, uh, then it would get the, the benefits of being a furry. Um, yeah. We'll probably do that. Oh, oh, and we're in hostile territory, so I don't get any health back by fortifying here. Oh, fuck off. Seriously, fuck off, dude. Fucking barbarians. Re. Alright, let's... Oh. Okay, that's nice. That's nice. You fortify. Okay, so you are mine. All right, well, let's go kill this bastard. There we go. Oh. I don't have, I don't have a uh, garrison for Kish, so that's probably part of why, uh, why they're so pissed off. Oma. You then go down and be a garrison for Kish. Oh, fuck's sake. Where are they getting these horses? Seriously. Yes. Build an embassy safely. Execute. Successfully established an embassy in the Aztec town of Tenochtitlan. Wonderful. All right. Oh, now we can uh, now we can uh, choose to steal their technology. Interesting. I'll probably come back to that. Yeah, we're gonna have that archer hang out until uh, until he's got a little bit more reinforcements. Kill them, please. Oh, uh, this this might not be good, actually. This might not be good if that city gets sacked. Um. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Come on. <laughs> They've carried away 20 gold. We must build our military. Sure, sure, sure. We're losing 5 gold per turn. Christ. Alright. So I think one way to deal with the uh, the barbarian encampments is to build an outpost. Because uh, I think barbarians only spawn where there's fog of war. 
Uh, so an outpost, like, right here in the mountains might be a smart thing to do. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and build a road to Kish here. Alright, you can be the garrison for Oma. Okay, I... Okay. Really need to stack archers under the uh, under the Ankidu because the Ankidu is better defensively. Yeah, let's go ahead and build a road to Kish here. Oh, for fuck's sake! You absolute son of a bitch! You motherfucker! There will be no mercy for you. There wasn't going to be mercy for you anyways, but, uh, definitely no mercy for you now. Come on, come on, beat the odds. Fuck! Massive barbarian uprising near Sumer. Great, just what I wanted to hear. Just what I wanted to hear. Okay. 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 Uh, should have killed that with the Yankee Do while I had a chance. there. Oh my god. Wow, okay. Yeah, that's a massive barbarian uprising. That's a massive barbarian uprising. All right. What the? Are you kidding me? Okay. Okay, this is this is just getting ridiculous at this point. Okay, who's next? Holy fucking shit. Barbarians are dangerous to Seth Thrones, yeah. Yeah, true, true, true. That's just fucking ridiculous. Okay. Um. So. Gonna have you bunch up, get some defensive bonus in the mountains if you can. Um. Yeah. Protect the city, at least. Yeah. Let's kill what we can. Because they're much weaker on defense than they are on offense, so... Yeah. Okay, oh, you running away? You scared? You see me ventilate your friend? Decided you wanted none of it? Let's go. Okay. We still we still need to get these goddamn archers down to down to the Americans and finish them off. It's getting a little ridiculous.
Alright. Yeah, we're gonna work on, uh, gonna work on getting roads. Oh boy. Can have you up in the mountains at least. Oh yeah, you can. You can hit him. Cool. We'll uh we'll bring an Anki do out too, just so you don't get absolutely raffle stomped on that flat land. All right. Oh, yeah, 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 attack the Enkidu in the mountains, by all means. By all means. I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. I'm cool with this. Not a scratch. All right. Yeah, I will take that all day and twice on Sunday. Have you build a palace instead? Um, yeah, er, is there... There's something more magnificent you can be doing with your time? Sure. Why don't you build a mausoleum for all the, uh... For all the people we just, uh, absolutely destroyed. Slowly but surely, I think we're building up enough critical mass to uh, finally take the Americans out. I don't think... I think they might be trapped in there. I don't know that they're settling more cities, so... As long as we got them trapped, we're, we'll get them eventually. Okay. Um, can we do something about these archers out in the open? These are all anky doos Which should be able to win? Or not. Oh, and you're... You Man, eat a gigantic dick. Eat a gigantic dick. Happiest nations. Oh, we're, we're, we're mediocre. I'll take mediocre at this point. Alright. Get the archers in there. Hopefully. Hopefully. Hopefully we'll be able to push San Francisco now. Or Boston. I think Boston is. Yeah, Boston's the bigger one. Never mind. Yeah, hopefully we'll be able to push Boston here. Next turn. It's a fucking settler. You're kidding. Okay. We can do this. It's gotta be enough. It's gotta be enough. That's some pretty shit rolls to close things out, buddy. Some pretty shit rolls. There we go. Alright. Now 
At least do damage. Come the fuck on. Wow. Wow. Oh, this, this fucker's gonna settle another city. This absolute son of a bitch is gonna settle another city. Alright, just fortify there. Can we, like, can we block their path, maybe? The land's pretty narrow. We can, we can maybe do something here. Very nice. Okay, hold out, hold out, hold out. Beautiful. All right. Okay, this needs to fucking die. <sighs> Do we count on... I think we count on that archer over there to catch it. Fuck me. Yeah. Get down there, try and block their path a little bit. I think that's the way to go. This music is... This music's pretty great, actually. Uh, you know what? I don't want to deal with you right now. Fucking many of them. Okay. Alright, we can catch him. In fact, yeah. Probably worth sending in our stack. Yeah, screw your saddler. Very nice. Keep building them roads. If you want to have cities, you've got to build roads. All right. We're going to have you continue working on the road, actually. Kind of connect our cities here. You can help. Okay, right. so we need to... Alright, well, we're building up a little bit of a stack. I want to get some archers, for sure. God damn it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Not what I needed you to do. Um, Settler, or sure. Sure, we can go with Settler. Oh, you're still healing. Oh, 
Okay, well, that's fucking infuriating. I mean, I knew I kind of had a disadvantage there, but still. Five to three. Five to three. It doesn't mean a damn thing. Oh my god, stop! Uh, do a temple. What? No. Not what I wanted to do. All right. All right. We're taking the city this turn. I'm resolved. We're taking the city this turn. Okay. And they have... They have more. Okay, so they got three spearmen. Oh. Alright, you know what? This is not worth it. At this point, this is not worth it. Uh, yeah. Give me some shit. No. That's it. Goodbye. That's enough of that for now. We'll come back. We've crippled them. We'll come back and we'll take them out. Christ. <laughs> uh, all right. All right, we need to balance our budget somehow. Right. Temple of Artemis, sure. Sure. What I don't need is you guys uh, making more uh, military units right now. It's freaking expensive. Here, can you do like... Do a temple. Yeah, do a temple. Do a temple. Praise be to God for that for that absolute bullshit war. At least we got their capital. We we checked their expansion. I think we're firmly in control of the northern part of this continent now. So So good things happening. Good things happening. Have a doom stack sitting on Washington for when they try to take it back. Yeah, this is an interesting aspect of the Civ games that kind of went away in the new ones. Like the whole idea. Roads, mines, irrigate. Yep. Yes, sir. That's an interesting aspect of the Civ games that kind of went away. Um, just the whole notion of the Doom stack. Newer Civ games, you can only have uh, one unit per tile. Kind of lame, you ask me. Oh, I see they just rebuilt rebuilt their cities in the jungle. Wonderful. Nicely done. Uh, 
Oh. Nice of you to clear those barbarians. Now get the hell out. Okay. So much for the Temple of Artemis. Uh, mathematics, literature, monarchy. That might be good. Statue of Zeus. Produce an ancient cavalry every five turns. Nice. Uh, what does a courthouse do? Decreases corruption in the city, makes the city more resistant to propaganda. Sounds good to me. Go ahead and, uh, yeah, irrigate the grasslands outside of Sumer since it's not growing. Uh, food one, shields one. Mountains are obviously a huge problem, yeah. Yeah, okay. It's gonna be a pretty marginal city, I think. Just the hill country is not good for food. Our treasury is running dangerously low. Ah, so it is, so it is. Um, how pissed off would people be if I cut the bread and circuses a little bit? How many people would be in a would be in a, in an uproar? Guess we'll find out. America declared war on the Aztecs. Okay, yeah, yeah. Yeah, cutting the bread and circus is, uh... Maybe not the play. Maybe not the play. Oh, okay. What are you doing? Building a road to what? Give me friggin' iron. This little bastard's gonna settle a city right here. Look at this. Look at this. Hold the mine. I guess I can't irrigate it, huh? Alright, fine. <laughs> okay. Well, cutting the bread and circuses was not the play. So I guess we'll cut science instead. You absolute... Okay. No, 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 no. No. No, 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 no. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. You're fucking dead, kiddo. Absolutely unacceptable.
Absolutely unacceptable. America is expansionist. So they are. So they are. I guess, I guess we'll take it so they can't have it. All right. Um. I really have no interest in trying to take the rest of their shit, but, um, I don't know. Probably station that guy in the mountains, uh, just so they can't send anything towards Uma there. Um, hmm. I guess I could do another city up here, maybe. Actually, have you garrison that city and then we can pull the archer off for, uh, you know, offensive stuff. really are expansionist. help us get new troops down to uh down to the battlefront really quick uh, this was not a good idea no yeah Yeah, that's about right. Okay, and you can bombard. That's good shit. So I think they can damage uh, they can damage enemies and uh, and cities without actually attacking the city. So very very valuable. Whoa. I just wasn't going to accept that city in there. If you want a peace treaty, fine.
Okay, they can't cross my borders at least, right? I don't suppose I can uh, buy a tile, can I? Nah. Nah, nah, nah. Really want to get those furs under control. Whoa, wait. Did I just make a worker fortify? I sure did. I right know, just automate. Where are you at? Oh, you're at Washington. Okay. Yeah. Oh shit. Oh shit. That's that's a problem. That's a problem. Great excuse to test out our catapult maybe. Oh, hey. Remove your forces from our territory. The Americans declared war on us. Nice. Okay. Okay, we're gonna be like that, I guess. Get the hell out of the terror out of my territory. Get the hell out. <laughs> America is expansionist, yeah. I'm not, I'm not used to them being able to, like, go into your borders if they don't have an orp open border treaty. So it kind of took me by surprise. I thought, okay, like, I've, I've sealed off, I've sealed off, like, the, the whole peninsula here. They're not going to be able to get in and snag any of the marginal land there, but, uh, nope. Guess they will. All right. Let's see if the catapults can make a difference. Once again, kind of take up positions on the heights overlooking Boston. Unleash a uh, unleash a jolly bombardment. You know the catapults have to be protected by troops. I I am aware. Yeah. I'm uh, moving troops with them. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. The Aztecs are dunking on them too. All right. You know what? Cool. Cool. All right. Very nice. 
Artillery bombardment successful. Alright, uh, Enkidu... Yeah. Just stand on the uh, artillery there. Alright. Artillery bombard... Oh, it can fail. Okay. Good to know. Our treasury is running dangerously low. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. comes over the mountain. Did you mine that gold? Uh, yes, I believe so. I mined it. I put a road there. It should be, uh, it should be pretty kosher. Uh, it's still not enough. Tour bombardment failed. Okay. That's a terrible idea if he dies, though. Ooh. Alright. Nice! There's the first swordsman! Okay. This will definitely turn the tide. Place that Enkidu warrior. Um, I think you're the only one. Aha, uh -huh. you're not. Can we can we kill this guy with the uh, catapults? Let's find out. Uh, maybe, maybe not. don't think they can reach us. Yeah, alright. Get onto the death stack here.
All right. Doesn't matter that the treasury is running low because we are going to take this damn city. We are going to plunder it very thoroughly. Very nice. All right. Very nice. Okay, okay, okay. The mouse is kind of fiddly, man. Okay, okay. There's the swordsman. Three, two, one. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Okay. Well, this will definitely break the stalemate if nothing else does. Eh. Huh. Wow. The Aztecs have a lot of shit. A lot of really nasty shit. Alright. Hopefully we can snipe, uh... Sending our wounded archers out is kind of suicide. At least while that archer is hanging around. All right, we'll let uh, <laughs> we'll let the Aztecs take some of the heat. They look like they can uh, they look like they can handle it. We're so fucking close. We're so fucking close. and tear. Uh, the Aztecs make me kind of nervous. <laughs> the Aztecs make me really kind of nervous. Oh my god, look at all the swordsmen. Alright, why don't you just... Um, actually, yeah, let's work on a courthouse. swordsmen do you have? Okay, well, we need to be pretty much immediately preparing to deal with the Aztecs, I guess. Christ. Alright. That's not great. Okay, that's really not great. We'll uh, go ahead and wait for next turn. <laughs> I 
<laughs> yeah. That's how you actually take a city. Oh boy. Holy fuck. <laughs> um. <laughs> um hmm. Well, Well, I don't know about our chances here. If the uh, if the Aztecs immediately go hostile, which, if I recall, they're a pretty aggro AI. <laughs> Shit, how many spearmen do you have? Guess we're about to find out. Give me some luck with the bombardments here. Give me some. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'll take luck on the combat rolls then. That is acceptable to me. Turns around and gives me nothing. Jesus Christ. Uh, okay. Oh, and of course the swordsman's gonna be here. I think he's just gonna miss the bus here. Alright. That's good. We need to start building swordsmen if we're gonna compete with the uh, Aztecs here. Nope, just made it elite. Fuck. They're gonna get the they're gonna get the city. They're gonna get the damn city. Oh, God played right into their hands. Ugh. Yeah, that's a serious problem. That is a serious problem. Yeah, everybody built swordsmen. Yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Wake all. Man, that sucks. Played right into their hands. Played right into their hands. Army's pretty freaking ridiculous. Go back. Go back. Paging Aztec forces have destroyed the Americans, uh-huh. 
And I think we're next. I think we are next. Uh, yeah, why don't we... Why don't we have people build walls? That might be the play. Yeah, do more catapults, please. Yeah. yeah, things not looking great with the Aztecs. Things not looking great with the Aztecs. At least I wasn't the first one eliminated this time, though. Oh, speaking of, what the fuck are you doing? Who the fuck are you? How about you get out of my borders? The Maya. Uh-huh. Bet I know how Smoke Jaguar is gonna respond to this. Yeah. Yeah, that's about right. Oh. All right, well, we'll, uh, send our swordsmen up to deal with this pain in the ass. Going on their merry way. All right. Always hated you couldn't choose your uh, level of response. How do you mean? How do you mean level of response? Like, uh, may have gone better if you top told them to buzz off and stop pestering the chickens. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Maybe. All right. So yeah, we're gonna have to. <laughs> uh, and the fact that we're at war with the Mayans makes an attack from the Aztecs even more likely. Uh, yeah, ooh, do a harbor. Yeah, definitely. We're gonna get gems, that'll be nice.
Frickin' swarming around us. Uh, anything more productive you can do? Give me another catapult, actually. I'm so screwed. I am so screwed. The declaration of war from the Aztecs is coming any second now. The ideal would be for them to, like, uh, start fighting the Mayans instead. I think I should probably make peace with the Mayans as soon as I can. And hope that, uh, yeah, the Aztecs turn towards them instead of me. And if they do that, maybe, uh, unless the Aztecs against the Mayans, I hear they don't get along. Uh-huh. Gil Gilgamesh, the Aztec medieval infantry thirst for your blood. Give us what we want or perish. Okay, I think they are much more, uh, yeah. Yeah, they outnumber us. They're technologically advanced. Um, yeah, fine. I guess we negotiate with terrorists. Cause I don't like the sound of medieval infantry. I uh, yeah, probably probably down to uh like having no science budget. That's that's probably part of why I don't have medieval infantry. Um, let's see. Um, Ur's gonna go... yeah. Ur and Washington will, will both go if we... if we touch the bread and circus budget. We might just have to operate at a loss here for a little while. Shit. Yeah? Yeah, why don't I, uh, why don't I talk, see if the Mayans, or see if the Aztecs are willing to help us, uh, with the Mayans. Rain of Passage. Literature, Currency, Monarchy, Construction. Whew! Military Alliance versus the Maya. They will probably be insulted by deal. What would you need for an alliance versus the Maya? It can't be done. Okay. Oh, here come the Maya. What the fuck are those? <laughs> what are those? <laughs> Ancient cavalry. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay. Not a fan. Not a fan. All right. I think our best chance here is, uh, yeah, getting the swordsmen out there and just kind of cutting them to pieces. If we can. Probably want to get probably want to get an archer in there as well. Uh, yeah. 
Get an archer in the city itself if I can. Alright, you're wounded. Uh-oh. Okay. I don't know don't know how much help the Ankydus will be. Oof. That's really not good. That's really not good. Woohoo! The people love me! I think they're gonna love me a lot less when I lose this uh, city. Alright. You can get in this turn, so please do. Let's, we'll try and distract some of them at least. Hey, what are you? Are you like a... Eh, hey, yeah, fuck your general. Okay, this is good. I'd rather you attack the Doomstack than attack the city, honestly. Well, that went poorly. Man, I really wanted to get that archer into the city. Fuck! Good news is, I think our... Our sacrifice here might have saved the city, at least for a turn or two. Nice. The Knights Templar. Interesting. I can see you can see why you would consider that a uh, a wonder of the world, honestly. It's, they were very very unlike anything else in their time. The first NGO, you could argue. Nice. Oh, look at this baller. Let's go. Yeah, you took a lot with you. Good job. Buying us time to Zerg rush stuff in. Uh, I don't know about that catapult's chances. In fact, we might, uh, might need to tell you to alter your course here. 
Oh no, he can definitely hit me from there. Um... Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Walls are definitely coming in clutch here. Alright. That's not good. That's really not good. Giving them a catapult. Wh whose idea was it to give them a catapult? Okay, we'll, uh... We'll just go ahead and take that right uh, right on back and bombard your ass. Sistine Chapel in 870 AD. Impressive. Okay. I have an escort for it this time. That's a lot of them. Currency! Hey, yeah. Here's how the money works. All the money that you don't have, you know? In fact, let's just... Let's just have some of you do wealth. Alright. Got the catapult in. That's gonna be a big help. man. Alright. Uh, yeah, let's have you just go out and support him there. Wonderful. <clears throat> Getting really sick of these Mesoamericans. I must say. I must say. There is not much we can do. Yeah, fuck you. Not great if they're gonna go around us. Um, 
Well, let's have you, uh... And you... Both kind of bunker down here. Fuck. You guys willing to do a white piece? Doubt they will accept this proposal. Insulting that you table such a proposal. Well, fine, forget it. Nice. Come on. Get him. Get him. Yeah. All right. Um Ruin your day. Hey. Really? What's that? Jell and throw a two two one. Seriously? Alright. Oh uh, yeah, let's have the swordsman. Let's have the swordsman kill this guy. Got him. Yeah, I might send the Sankadu warrior out, try and get him out, uh, try and get him veteran status. Eh, it didn't work. Let's go before these bastards start pillaging us. Ah, didn't work. Yep, motherfuckers. There goes the iron. Fuck. Okay. Yeah, you damn well better get out there and fix it. So I guess the galleys can embark a unit. That's good to know. Mayo oh Mayan! Gilgamesh appears in my palace.
Can you just... <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye. We're getting close to a deal there. All he wants is Washington. Okay, so are these like... These must be strong against swordsmen or something, right? Or I'm having the most dog shit luck imaginable against the javelin throwers. down there. Fuck me. Hmm. Alright. There's a win against the javelin thrower. Nice. Okay. Okay. The mob destroyed the temple. The people love you. Nice. Um, yeah, if we can get that archer down there, that would be really cool. Come on, come on. Put some ass into it. There we go. I think this idiot strayed too close to Washington. He did. Alright. Rip him to shreds.
not sure what I was thinking there, actually. Thought for some reason that he was a uh, two uh, two offense, but no, he's two defense. So that was dumb. Um, actually, nobody in range. Cavalry, ooh. Houston might actually be kind of vulnerable. Um, let me get... At least one of the Ankydus up there. No, you're gonna go that direction? Okay. We can do that. It's a freaking forest! The cavalry should really not be performing well there. They really shouldn't. We'll send this regular Ankidu out. I won't miss it if it fails. Fair enough. Oh. God, I forgot cavalry pull that bullshit. Imagine running away. Imagine running away. <laughs> really? Our archer is the best we have there? Nice. Get wrecked. Alright, we have the means to kill a bunch of their cavalry, actually, so let's go ahead and do that. Uh, then again, probably wise not to overcommit. never ends. It never ends. Like, I'm sure I'm getting screwed out of a victory here, you know. Having to divert all these resources to, uh, to this shit. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Alright, well... We can kill them both. Alright, um, but kill them with what? Actually, let's see if we can kill them with a, uh, with a bombardment. No, it won't even let me. Alright. Okay. I just needed you to get one. I just needed you to get one. Oh my god. Okay.
<laughs> There's the medieval infantry. Uh, okay. Alright. You need to fuck off. All right, I don't want to give up a city. Fuck. All right. All right, fuck your medieval infantry. Hopeless Sumerians are the smallest nation in the world. Uh, okay. Wonderful! Really, really worth the effort I put into producing you. Alright. I'm gonna try and get some reinforcements over to, uh, over to Washington here. So yeah, I kind of just kind of just ended up in another war that I really didn't want. Game's hard. Game's really, really hard. <laughs> I remember it being difficult to uh, to win on anything higher than chieftain, especially. Catapult, we have a swordsman. Okay, you know what? Since he's gonna take it anyway, we'll uh, give him Washington to make peace. Pretty fucking annoying. Pretty fucking annoying. All right. So I think I'm probably going to leave it off here. I uh, don't think this one's going anywhere, but uh, yeah, probably going to try with a different seed at some point later. Um, well, it's nice being on the uh, on the tip of the continent. You do run into, uh, yeah, not a lot of uh, directions you can expand. So yeah, that kind of hobbled us a bit. But uh, yeah, it was, uh, the game is, uh, I, I'm glad I'm, how to put it? I feel a little vindicated that I sucked at the game when I was a kid, because, yeah, it's it's genuinely hard. It's, well, I don't know if it's, say, hard, but yeah, generally a lot harder than the uh, than the modern Civ games, that's for damn sure. And this is on one of the easier difficulties. Her. 
So yeah, we're gonna leave it off there. Uh, thank you all so much for coming out. I uh, I, uh, I had a lot of fun with it. Man, the nostalgia goggles are strong. The nostalgia goggles are strong. Um, it's cool to play this again. Uh, but yeah, appreciate y'all coming out. Uh, tomorrow, going to be doing a very special Valentine's Day stream with a perfect date. Because a cat is fine too, and uh, so is toxoplasmosis. I <laughs> uh, hope you all have a wonderful, uh, wonderful rest of your week. Hope to catch you again tomorrow at 10 p.m. Eastern. Um, and yeah, that's going to do it for me. So until next time, I'm Iki. I bid you wale. Take very, very good care of yourselves. I'll see you all again real soon. Later!